stormy strike here and oh my gosh I got a lot of stuff here so what happened was Walmart has had Walmart near my where my dad works was having a clearance on Schleich and normally the places I go to don't have Schleichs very often only Toys R Us and their stuff is sometimes on clearance but not usually anyway so like a bunch of Schleichs were on clearance and like they were such good deals I had to buy a kind of a lot of them as you can probably see by these bags so I'm gonna go ahead and show you the awesome really cool Schleichs I got for pretty great prices I'm really excited so here we go uh where should we start I guess I'll start with uh, the animals here that are kind of in their bags oh some of them got kind of just thrown together but, but that's okay we'll we'll manage it so first off here in this bag this little cutie a uh, cute little Schleich mare I have her already I believe so I'll probably end up like repainting this one or something or doing something with her I don't know I really really love this one though it's like one of my favorite of the newer Schleichs, because I don't really collect the new Schleichs too much because I mostly like the older horses and stuff. I mean, like, I collect the new Schleichs of other animals, but not of horses. I don't know. I have no idea what I'm saying. Anyway, this girl is so, so cute. Look at her. I just love her, and I am pretty sure I have her already, so this one I might end up, like, doing some customizing or something with. But I had to get her. I mean, three bucks, I had to get her. So, so, so cute. And then, also here, I got some other animals, which I have other Schleich animals, but not like a huge amount of them, and I kind of want to collect more of them anyway, though. And anyway, I got this really cool tiger. Look at that tiger. It's super cool. Very nicely done tiger. So, so cool. I absolutely love this tiger. This, this is just such a cool tiger. They also had a lion, but the lion wasn't done as nicely, so I ended up just getting the tiger. Again, $3. I had to get it because really nicely done one. They're just absolutely gorgeous. Beautiful Schleich like Tiger. Really, really like that one. And then this one um, might actually end up being my mom's because she really likes likes this too because she really likes deer a lot. But um, this little uh, stag here, really cute as well. So he's either going to end up in my collection or my mom's collection. We'll, we'll find out eventually. But yes, very, very cute. Nice little deer. And then this one I actually almost got um, before at a different Walmart for about the same price, but I didn't. I was like, you know what, I should just go ahead and get this guy. This is a really cute little um, bison or buffalo. Is it a bison? Yes, American bison. So he's really cute. Look at, the, look at that face. Look at those eyes. That is so cute. So yeah, he is super adorable. I really, really like him. He's a great little, little guy to go with the horses, I think. My horsey schleichs. I also got a hyena because I just figured why not <laughs> again they, are, they were three dollars each so I couldn't help it uh, for some reason some of them say four on the bottom yet they're they, they three there I don't know I got them for three so I don't know Walmart's kind of weird sometimes when they are clearancing stuff and anyway I got this cute little hyena because I was like yeah I just can't pass it up it's kind of cute so I got the little hyena and I got this really nice grizzly bear Again, three dollars. Look how cool that grizzly ah, bear. Bah, bah. Look how cool this bear is. Like just how they did painted his fur, and the fur on it is just really nicely done. I'm not a huge. I'm not like a huge bear fan. Like fan of bears. I mean, I like them, of course. Like like I like pretty much all animals, but I'm not like a huge fan of bears. But this bear is really nice. I really really like him. Maybe I'll focus on his face. Come on, camera. There you go. Yeah, it's really cool. Like, look at that detailed mouth. It's just really, really nice. So when I saw him, I was just immediately, I had to get him. Especially because he was the only one there, too. The only bear there. So I had to get him because he was really cool. He also had a polar bear that was really cute, but I didn't end up getting that one. Because despite the fact that everything was on clearance, I tried to be good and not spend too crazy amount of money. Anyway, um, I also got a horse here. Let's take off this little cardboard thing, maybe. There we go. So I got this uh, Shire Stallion. He was actually four fifty. He was more than three for whatever reason. So that is really cool, though. This is again like one of the newer Schleichs that I actually do kind of really like. He's really pretty, really pretty horsey. Um, it's kind of weird looking on some aspects because I'm just not like I said. I don't collect the new Schleichs very much, but he's still very very cute and cool. I'm really glad they had him there and I was able to get him for. Uh, like, what is it, like half of the original price of him, pretty much? Yeah. So those were all the uh, animals and horses. They had a couple other horses, but I ended up just sticking with these two because one of them I already had and didn't need another one of, and 
I don't know. I can't remember. I can't remember what was there now, but yes, very, very cool. Oh, I did get a, at a different Walmart. I did get, like, they only had, like, two Schleichs on clearance, and one of them was a little full, which I have somewhere, and I don't remember where I put him, so I won't include him, but it was, like, a little shy full. He's really cute, too. All right, so now we got those guys out of the way. Let's see. Um, let's go on to the dinosaurs because they had a lot of dinosaurs there, and, of course, I had to buy, like, half of what was there. Oh, please don't get messed up. They're, they're all just thrown into the bag, unfortunately. <laughs> so you can see. Oh, that's lovely. Thank you. Thank you, Walmarts. Thank you for throwing everything into a bag. I love that very much. Okay, so I have this one already. I got him before at a Toys R Us, I think. A while ago for like full price. I got the Triceratops. But these guys are only $5 each, so I had to get more. Mostly to repaint a lot of these guys. I am going to be repainting them. Oh, I'm sorry if you can hear my dog barking in the background. So a lot of these I am probably going to be repainting them is the reason why I got them mostly. Because I, I already have oh, most of them already. So just getting them to repaint and stuff because I can't pass up on a price like that. So yeah, these guys, I really like this model too. Like this, this uh, mold is just really nicely done. Really, really cool. So yeah, one, at least one of these are going to get repainted. I don't know into what exactly, but something something or other they'll get repainted into different colors and i will let me go around on this side gotta watch out for that camera tripod all right so this guy this guy i ended up getting three of because i do not have him already get these guys out of the bag and again these ones were only five dollars each an offer i couldn't pass up so here's two of them Two of them, super cool. And then there's, this is the one that I'm gonna keep as it is. I'm not gonna repaint this one because it's the nicest one of them. But look at this guy, he's so cool. And what's funny is the fact that I was about to buy him from Toys R Us for like full price, over full price even a little bit. I mean like normal price, I don't know. He's a little expensive there. I was almost gonna buy him like two days before because um, I usually get like a little back to school present. <laughs> So I was thinking about getting him for like my little back to school present or whatever. Because I just really wanted him. I've been wanting him for a while now. But uh, I ended up not getting him because I was like, ah, well I can maybe get him a bit cheaper online. So I'll just wait. And then I find him at, uh, at Walmart for five bucks. So I am ecstatic about that. I absolutely love this guy. Oh my gosh, he is so gorgeous. I just love his coloring and this pose he's in too. Look at that dynamic pose. It's just super duper cool. And so of course I can't I couldn't just I couldn't just buy one with five dollars being them being five dollars I couldn't buy just one. So I bought two more to repaint or do whatever with. This one's actually kind of cool because he's like darker, so I might end up keeping one of the I don't know. I'm gonna repaint at least one though. Because I definitely want to start getting into repainting some dinosaur toys and stuff later. But yes, I am so ecstatic about these guys. I can't even with it. <laughs> it is so cool. And then here's another dino. This is the Schleich uh, Spinosaurus, which I actually don't really like this one that much because his color is kind of meh. I don't know. It's just, it's not great. But what I don't like about him is his face because he was, um, they repurposed a mold that originally didn't have a hinge jaw. I actually have the original Spinosaurus that they um, like changed the mold up to make into this scale and to give it a hinged jaw and so the mouth is just really wonky because when it was originally sculpted it was not meant to have a hinged jaw and so they um, kind of just like added that on there and so to me it looks really weird I don't know maybe it's just me that's like being really critical of it but he also like doesn't really have a tongue like he it looks like he doesn't have a tongue like he just has like I guess he does have a tongue but it doesn't look like he does <laughs> like it's really weird but anyway um I still got him anyway because he was ten dollars for some reason, one tag said 19, but then another set, but then like they had another tag on and said 10, so I got him for 10. So he's pretty cool. I may end up just like repainting him or doing something with him though, because I'm just not too fond of the coloring for some reason. It's kind of just very muddy, very mud muddled and muddy and just, I don't know. That's just me though, maybe, but it's still really cool though. I'm, I'm like, yeah, I'm going to totally get him for $10, even though he's not one of my favorites. And then I also got, ooh, come out of there, you. 
the Schleich Connoisseur, uh, Connoisseurs. Um, I have this one already. I got him for Christmas last year. But again, I was like, well, I gotta get another one <laughs> because he was only five bucks. Five bucks, even though for some reason it says Triceratops on there. I don't know. Like I said, Walmart's really weird on their clearancing on stuff sometimes. And so I did get him as well. Like I said, I don't know if I'll repaint him because I don't know if I'm gonna repaint him actually at all because he's got like the texture on him is really cool, but it's also really weird. I don't know if it'd be too hard to repaint. I don't know, but either way, he is uh, really cool, and my mom said that she would take him if I don't end up repainting him or whatever. So, I had to get him, too. This was the most expensive one I got, which by most expensive, I mean, like, super great priced. <laughs> so, he, here is the Giganotosaurus. Oh my gosh, he is so cool. Look, yeah, I love this one. This is the 2014, 2014 Giganotosaurus. I love this model. I was actually going to do a review on it, and I never did. I never got around to doing a review on this one. Because I already got this one um, a while ago. I can't remember when I got him. But yes, I already have this one, but this model is so freaking cool. I just, I love it. I don't know why, but he's just so cool and beefy and just like, just so cool looking. He's just a really cool model. I know his tail is stupid, like how it how it curves like that is really dumb, but um, like it's anatomically and like being correct for dinosaurs, it really doesn't make any sense why his tail curls like that. I know they did that to make him stand better or whatever, but I still think he's super duper cool and his colors are amazing. So I don't know if I'll actually repaint this one or not. I kind of want to though, because I mean, I think this guy would look super cool and like maybe a kind of like a black or a gray or just maybe some really cool like darker colors or something or even lighter colors i don't know this guy would look so cool in so many colors i just think he would be really cool to repaint so i might end up repainting him but yeah he was only uh 13 dollars and originally 25 so one i definitely had to get and like i said i don't know exactly what i'm gonna be doing with all of them like i know some of i am gonna repaint for sure this guy is just so cool oh my gosh i love this model he's just so cool he's really heavy too he's like he's like a rock he's so heavy but he is super duper cool. I really love him. And then lastly, I wasn't going to get this guy originally, but he was so sad just sitting there on a shelf all by himself. He needed to come home with me. This is Stumpy. <laughs> this is my little Stumpy Stump. So this poor little guy was on the shelf and he didn't have arms. Someone tore his arms off or something happened to his arms. We actually tried to look around to see if his arms were anywhere. Like, we looked around in the cleared section. I kind of looked around in the toy section. I was trying to see if, uh... Ooh, come on, camera. Would you focus, please? So I tried to see if, um... He had his arms somewhere. And I couldn't find them. So I was really bummed about that. And so I didn't... I, so I wasn't going to get him at first. Because I was like, uh, well, you know. He was five bucks, by the way. He was the same price as the those guys. But, um... I was like, ah, I don't know, you know, I, I don't, I don't want to buy a broken Velociraptor for five bucks. But I was felt so sorry for him. Like I went and put a couple of the Schleichs back that I decided I didn't really want to get because you know, I had too many. <laughs> but um, so I went back and I was like, you know what, I'm just going to go ahead and get him because he's so cute. <laughs> Even though he doesn't have arms, this, this model is so adorable, first of all. It's just like, it's really nicely done. It doesn't have a um, dew claw thingy, unfortunately, but it's still really, really cool little dinosaur toy. Like, I haven't seen this one in person before. And I was like, okay, you know what? I'm just going to get him anyway because he's so cute and he's like really nice too, except for the fact his arms are gone. He's actually a really nice little model. So what I'm going to end up doing is I'm going to fill up his um, arm holes because he has like holes in his arms from where his arms, I mean holes in his shoulders where his arms are supposed to be. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to fill those up with them, a little bit of clay and then paint them over and then make him stumpy and he's just going to be the little dinosaur that has no arms and that will be okay because he is so cute and adorable. I absolutely love him. He's going to be like probably a little mascot now because he is just... I just love him. He's adorable. I couldn't leave him behind at the store. I was like, I will be forever sad if this little guy never finds a home or whatever. So I needed him. I needed him and so he came home with everybody else. And so now I got really a little nice dinosaur squad going on here. On top of these guys that I got too. So I got a lot of um, 
a lot of schlikes and a lot of great deals. I wouldn't have bought this many if they were um, at regular price. I mean, I could barely buy, um, not barely buy, but I just, I didn't almost, I didn't buy this guy at his original price at Toys R Us. But I'm just, yeah, again, I'm so excited, so very excited that they actually had these guys, uh, so many good dinosaurs on clearance for, for cheap. I'm just really excited about that. So I'm very, very happy about that. And yeah, like I said, most of them will get repainted and stuff, and that'll be really fun to do. Um, I'll have to do videos when I start doing that. Although that won't be for a while now, because all my like I don't have a studio set up right now, so I can't really repaint stuff because there's like no room at the moment for me to do it, and my paint supplies are all over the place and things like that. But when I do start repainting things, I will uh, definitely be doing videos and stuff on that. So that is all for this video. I will see you guys in the next video. I don't know what video is going to be next exactly. I do need to do a, probably an updates video about just different stuff. But anyway, um, I'll see you guys in the next video. I hope you enjoyed this and I hope you all have an awesome day. Bye!